Hello guys, in this Talent tutorial, we are going to cover how to exclude head and trailer from a file using Talent Open Studio. So I have uh, recently covered a post on this topic. I will give you this blog link in the description. You can have a look and if you have any question, you can uh, you know, ask your question in the comment or you can uh, ask questions on my blog also. So this is the standard layout of the file. We generally get the header and trailer from an input file, but while processing the file, we do not bother about header and trailer. We just have to use this detailed records. So that is what we are going to do, like how to skip this header and trailer from an input file. Basically, if you have worked on some ETL tools before, like I have worked on data stage. So in the data stage, we have to write one command, one Unix command to exclude header and trailer. And if you are not going to use any command, then we have to use some other component to skip the header and trailer record. Like in, in data stage, we can use transformer. Uh, to skip the header and trailer record but in talent there is one benefit like we don't have to use any kind of external component or internal component we can uh, talent already provides a feature that we can use to skip header and trailer from an input file so let's check how to do it in talent so for this i have created a very simple job it's uh, just to read that file i have uh, I am using the T input file delimited component. If you don't know like uh, how to use this component, you can go there, browse for this component, search for it, find component, or you can, if you remember the component na name, then you can just type it here. You know, I, I just love this feature of uh, talent. So you can just type it here and select your component. It will become like this. So right now I'm deleting this because I have already used it. Same you can use for the T log row. And I'm, I have just uh, connected this component. It's a very simple thing. Just wanted to show like, um, you know, in, in the output, uh, we, would, we would be getting only the detailed records. Just wanted to show how to skip header and trailer. So same thing will be reflected in the T log row. It, it works as a output console, means you can see what is happening in the output just by using this component it will display everything here only so uh, before that one what we have to do because we are going to read an input file we have to define its metadata right means it will work as a it will it's it, it's kind of a schema that we have to use before reading a file so and as you already know if you have covered if you have gone through my blog or if you have covered some previous videos then I you know, always suggest uh, this like use the repository schema as you know like talent is having two kind of schema one is the repository and one is the built-in so once you define anything in repository it will be there only and if you are going to skip header and tailor then you know specifically you have to use the repository schema only so what do you have to do for that one you have to go in the metadata section you can see here it's a job design and after that you will find this metadata section here you have just have to right click and create file delimited so i have created a file i will walk through it so what you have to do because you are going to create a new file then you have you have to click on this create file delimited i have already created it so I will just go there and edit file delimited. So you have to provide a name over here. I have given just you know input file with head and tail. You can give any name over here. After that, you just have to click on next and you have to browse for your file. So in my case, I will go with txt, it's already there. So that is what I have selected. After that, you can based on your OS, you can define the format. In my case, it's Windows. So once you select this one you will get a preview file preview so right now you can see it is having header detail and trailer cross and this that is what coming from the input file so we are okay with this next we will click on next and here we have to define some things uh, so what you have to do because in my case the separator is a space you know i have already shown this one if you haven't checked it then let me open this again so you can see here i have got a lot of spaces over here so it works as a delimiter in my case so in your case it may be a semicolon semicolon file or uh, you know some other character file though. so you have to define that as a field separator so in my case it's a space you can all you can also say it's a tabulation semicolon space 
a lot of options are there so I, I will define as a space and after that to see you can see a rows to skip so if I am not going to select it and I hit on refresh preview so you can see I am getting the header here and and you know footer here it's a trailer record what I have to do I have to skip these records so what I will do I will click on header and I will select one you can see here we can skip any number of rows so I will select one because this will be the first row and I want to skip it same for the footer from the bottom I want to select I want to skip first row so it will be one only after that when if I hit refresh also I am not getting any hit heading in my input file so I haven't checked this box if you are getting some headings like uh, you know it's like name address and some other things if you want to set the heading then you can just select just just check this box and it will come in your input file but in my case I'm not getting any heading so I'm not checking this box so see uh, now as I have checked this these boxes I'm not getting anything here the I'm not getting any header record and I am not getting any trailer record it's just the detail records and that is what we want right so can click on finish ok so it's already there so because in my case it's already it has been already set up correctly so I can skip this thing also and if you are doing any modification and you want to propagate those modification in the all jobs then you can select yes also but I haven't changed anything so I will skip it okay so once you are done with your uh, metadata okay, you will get these things column 0 1 1 2 6 okay so once you are done with the with your metadata you have to do some settings in your T in T input delimited component because based on this only we are going to read the file so first of all what you have to do you have to select a repository from the drop down once you select the repository you will get this option here metadata and you have to select your metadata in my case it's this only input file with header and trailer so that I have selected once I select uh, yeah, this metadata all all other columns will be automatically populated like file name will come like this because we have already selected this the row separator will be and field separator will be space header and footer will come as one one and this is schema will will get already will get automatically selected so it's a repository and again it will come like this so you don't have to, you don't have to define anything here okay even if you want to see the schema you can check it so it's what we defined over there based on that one everything is getting populated automatically so once you define everything at the repository level you don't have to do anything over here you can just go with it so now what we have to do we have defined everything and now we want to see the output so for that we just have to run this job I'm going to run this job. It will take some, it will take few seconds. So as you can see here, uh, we are just only getting the detail records. We are not getting header and trailer. The column zero to column six. Also, if you want to check at the execution level, you can see only four rows are getting passed from input delimiter file to T log row so that is what we wanted right okay so that's all for this video if you want to check some other talent video then uh, you can go to my channel i have already created up this playlist and i will keep adding one new videos on talent so just like it subscribe it and 
हैप्पी टर्निंग